Hey there, Excel learners. Have you ever needed to track running totals or see what percentage of your total sales each value contributes as you go? Well, today, I'm going to show you how to calculate a cumulative percentage in Excel. Whether you use the quick analysis tool or a manual formula, I've got you covered. Let's dive right in. First, let's get our cumulative totals in place. These will be the foundation for our cumulative percentage. Start by selecting all the values you want to perform the calculation on. Now look closely. At the bottom right of your selection, you should see a little button pop up. That's the Quick Analysis tool. Click on it. Go to the Totals tab. Select Running Total from the options. And just like that, Excel will generate a running total for your selected data. But hold on, I know what you're thinking. That's not the cumulative percentage yet. You're right. This is just our starting point. Now let's manually create the formula so you fully understand how it works. If for some reason the quick analysis tool doesn't work for you, don't worry. You can do it manually using the sum function. Here's how. Formula for cumulative total equals sum open parenthesis dollar sign a dollar sign 2, colon, A2, close parenthesis. That dollar sign is key. It stops the first cell from changing when you drag the formula down. If you forget to add it, your cumulative total won't work correctly. Once you've entered the formula, press enter and drag it down to apply it to all rows. Boom. Now you've got your cumulative total set up manually. Now let's move on to the actual cumulative percentage calculation. All right, now for the fun part. Finding out what percentage of the total each row represents as we go. To calculate cumulative percentage, we divide the cumulative total by the sum of all values in the column. Formula for cumulative percentage equals sum, open parenthesis, dollar sign A, dollar sign 2, colon, A2, close parenthesis, divided by sum, open parenthesis, dollar sign A, dollar sign 2, colon, dollar sign A, dollar sign 10, close parenthesis. Breaking it down. The numerator keeps growing as we move down the column. The denominator is the fixed total sum of all values. Again, the dollar signs lock that second sum range in place, so it doesn't change as you copy the formula down. At this point, the values might look like 0.35, 0.65, 1.00, and so on. Let's make them look like actual percentages. Select the column with your cumulative percentage formula. Go to the number formatting drop down at the top. Choose percentage. Now your values are displayed as 35%, 65%, 100%, making it super clear what portion of the total each row represents. Want a quick keyboard shortcut? Just press Ctrl plus Shift plus Percentage to instantly apply percentage formatting. Now that everything is working perfectly, just drag the formula down to apply it to all rows. You now have a fully working cumulative percentage calculation. Did this tutorial help you? Let me know in the comments. And if you're enjoying these Excel tips, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe for more easy Excel tutorials, Hit the bell icon so you never miss an update. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.